Hi, in this video, we're going to take a look at a list of all the available uh, commands for your voice control on iPhone. So uh, with uh, voice control activated, there is a lot of things that you can do, but um, you, may, you may need to know the command first before you can start using it. So first, let's go back to your home screen by swiping up at the bottom, then tap on the settings icon. Next in uh, settings, we want to uh, tap on accessibility then tap on voice control make sure it is um, switch on and once it is switch on you can see there is a blue uh, circle that uh, indicate voice control is uh, turned on now if you like tap on customize uh, commands you can see here you got you can uh, create a custom uh, command or you can use some of the default command that is already available so let's look at the basic navigation command in here you got open app switcher you got open control center open notification center open spotlight open Siri and open application name so whatever the application that you have on your phone you can say open the application uh, you can say go home which go back to your home screen go back which go back to the previous screen or you can say tap and then item name whatever it is on the screen you can say let's say tap on the back button uh, tap on whatever display on your screen it will tap on the item uh, you can set the item name uh, show me what you say so when you say that it will come up with a, a list and show you an example of what you can say uh, show commands show vocabulary search for search web for go to sleep wake up repeat times so uh, let's say if you um, open up a list you can say repeat five times uh, make this speakable start recording commands stop recording commands so they are the basic navigation command using voice control next you got the overlays command overlay commands basically uh, show the names and numbers uh, on the screen so I'm just going to turn on voice control so I can show you um, so what's the choice turn on overlays and then say show name you can see it shows the name show numbers and then show the numbers of each items in the list right here high numbers so I'm just going to turn off voice control now so it tells us the things that you can do show numbers show numbers continuously high numbers show names show names continuously high names show grid so show grid with count columns show grid with columns in and show grid with and then you got all this show grid and then you got tap tap on number five for example or choose number five uh, choose all so for example if there's a list of five things you can ask it to choose which one or you can choose all show action actions for show actions for number and then that's the overlays and then you've got basic gestures and then you've got here you can ask the phone to scroll down scroll up scroll to bottom scroll to top scroll left scroll right scroll to left edge scroll to right edge zoom in zoom in item name zoom in number zoom out zoom out item name zoom out number decrement decrement so go down by one go down by one or go down by um, an item name by how many times so decrement by numbers and then you got increment uh, single tap double tap so you can ask the phone to mimic the action of your finger tapping on your phone uh, one time or two times uh, or double tap on a certain item or an item name uh, you can long press so let's say long press on the camera that will basically bring up uh, a menu so let's uh, do an example of that so I'm going to turn on voice control and then go back to the home screen and say long press camera you can see it comes out with a menu so that's what you can do so go to customize command and then so you got basic gestures so you got lots of things you can do you can see you can long press pan down you can pan in each of the different directions you can rotate use the rotate command swipe command uh, then you can use two fingers command two fingers tap double tap or long press 
uh, pan down to finger pan right pan up pan down pan left oops so it actually does what I'm telling it to do so I'm just gonna turn off force control so we are with some basic uh, basic gestures and you can see there's a lot of things you can do then you got advanced gestures so you got the drag uh, start dragging drop uh, tap and hold tap and hold or you can cancel gestures then you got uh, dictation so you can say insert date enter that add to vocabulary dictation mode command mode now okay let's go down then you got text navigation okay so you ask you can ask things to move down move up move left move right move to beginning to the end then you got move forward backwards and basically move up and down you can move to the paragraph uh, which paragraph which sentences or which words so it's very very uh, complex when you um, uh, look at it you can do a lot of things but you need to first learn all these commands before you can issue the right commands for it to work so that's the text navigation then you got text selections and here's a uh, text selection or the things that you can do with uh, text selections so you can see it's quite a lot in here and then you can do text editing so you can ask it to replace insert correct that correct a phrase undo redo cut copy paste capitalize capitalize lowercase that lowercase a phrase uppercase that bold italic italic um italic size italic size underline that so you can do underline you got text deletions and then you got device device is like uh, performing some of the things that you would normally press on the hard key or hardware key such as turn down the volume or turn up the volume uh, mute sound unmute sound rotate to landscape lock the screen make emergency call shake device triple press on the buttons um, take a screenshot or even reboot the device and then you got um, accessibility so then here you got a lot of stuff in here as well some of the things can be done via Siri so you can ask Siri to do some of these things otherwise you can use uh, voice control to do some of the things so yeah it tells, these are all the commands that all the default commands that comes with the, this voice control features now you can tap on the custom and then if you create a new command you can actually ask it to do um, a custom command such as uh, what action that app will support so depending on the apps um, 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 it, what, whatever its uh, function is it support so for example if it accept a uh, voice input command of uh, let's say shoot then uh, uh, on a camera you can say shoot and then you can issue the command to take your photos so it's depending on the application and then you can choose which application can accept uh, voice control and that's it so that is very uh, complex um, command that you can use on your iPhone thank you for watching this video please subscribe to my channel for more videos